Hello everyone and welcome back to more Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Tag Force 2! Yesterday we were able to get more of the... Well, we were able to unlock the Neos pack. Unfortunately though, we have yet to pull actual Neos himself, so I'm not able to build the deck I want for Jaden. But that's fine right now because... Well, today we are going to be going to do, do a tournament. So that's going to be interesting. Alright, so Jane got a little bit extra friendship. Awesome. Uh, let's see if we'll get more from the Raw Dorm. Oh well. Alright, and that's it for this day, so now it's tournament time! Alright, so good morning, Gabe. Looks like I'm before you again. Oh, today's the dual tournament. Yes, I will go to the tournament. Alright! So today, we have the Obelisk Blue Tournament. This is gonna be stinking tough, so get ready. Alright. So, well... Alright, so now we're gonna go and duel these guys. This is gonna get rough, so be prepared for that. Okay, draw. Next one! Crud. That's okay, though. Alright, who's gonna be going... S okay, I'm gonna be going first. I'll take it. Or in this case, Jaden will be going first, which might not be the best thing ever, but hey, we'll see. Alright, so... Okay, Jane has an alright starting hand to work with, so he's going to add Blade Edge, play Foolish Burial, and he's going to summon Stratos to use his effect, adding another copy of Wild Heart. Cool. Alright, so he's just going to go ahead and set a couple of cards face down and fine with that. I'm going to go ahead and activate E-Call, so I can go ahead and add my copy of Stratos. I'm going to MST that face down just because I don't trust it. Okay, it's Spirit Barrier. Thought so. Right, I'm going to go ahead and send him in Wild Heart, though, for the heck of it, because I want to save my Stratos for a moment. Okay, so Pablo's deck is just full of search monsters, isn't it? All right. Come on. There we go. She's gone, but she's going to get replaced by another copy of herself. Great. Fine enough, Warrior Lady of the Wasteland is actually the... Monster who turns into DD Warrior Lady. Okay, aliens. Why do I have a good feeling those are like... Actually, I think that's like the most played deck by some of the students in this game. Don't know why. I mean, don't get me wrong, aliens are cool and all, but... Oh well. Alright, so there's Wild Edge who's gonna rip this deck apart. Alright, Premature Burial bring Blade Edge back, so that means we'll be able to do quite a lot of damage. Oh, wait, why didn't he just end? Why did he just do that? Does the Field Cell do something? Oh, okay, so that's what... Well, we won't have to worry about that anymore, will we? Say hello to Grand Mole! I already wasted my normal summon, gosh dang it, okay. I just wasted it, but that's fine. Grand Mole, do your thing! Doesn't matter. Because I'm going to use this effect. I stinking love Grand Mole so much. It's just one of those funny cards to use. Oh my lord, he's just going to keep spamming these guys. Cool. Wild Edge, cut them all down. Get the crud out. And turn end. Alright, so this guy's just going to set more cards face down. Nice! Jane got Morphing Jar! That'll definitely be able to help him out. Alright, now we're going to be able to do some good damage. Awesome. Okay, he's going to set Morphing Jar face down. Fantastic. Oh, crud, we're going to lose Stratos now. Oh well. Alright, time to win this. So, first things first. I think I'm going to play Miracle Fusion. So now, let's go! Wild Wingman? Yeah, we're going Wild Wingman. Here he is, ready to kick all sorts of butt. Alright. Wild Wingman, do your thing. So we're gonna use his effect to discard Avion. To destroy that. Use his effect again. Uh, I did not want to discard Grand Mole. That was a, that was a misclick there, but that's okay. Use your effect again. Discard Bubble Man to destroy that. 
And finally, we're going to go ahead and discard Bristinatrix to destroy that final face, that spirit barrier. Now I'm going to go ahead and equip Wild Wingman with good old Mage Power, boosting him to 29. All right, get him, Wild Wingman. And that's game. Get the crud out of here. All right, so far, so good. Yeah, we got some good DP, so that means we'll be able to invest more into that booster pack. All right, first round, done. All right, and now on to the next ones. We're going to go fight these two. Oh, this... Oh, please go well. All right, scissors. Nice. All right, so for this one, we're going to go first. Since that worked out really well for us last time, so hopefully it goes well this time. All right, so first things first, Jane's going to, well, go first. Nice, he's going through the smart move and adding Stratos to his hand. Adding Blade Edge. Not as good, but oh well. All right, so A-forces, that could potentially be a problem if that is allowed to linger. But thankfully, we've got Grand Mole to just completely mess with my opponent. Uh, set called the Haunted face down for the heck of it. And then we can go ahead and activate Our Righteous Justice. Aw, oh, man. I should have done Our Righteous Justice first then. All right, get rid of that. Move into battle. We'll just go ahead and have Stratos destroy Command Knight for now. Since there's no point in bouncing it back to my opponent's hand. Since Grand Mole can be used as a shield in this game. Since that means if anyone dares attack Grand Mole, then, well, that monster's getting bounced. All right, good. Jane's move. Doesn't really have much to work with. That's a Waboku. But he's still going to use Grand Mole's effect to bounce that monster back. No, don't set the Grand Mole! Ah. No! This is what happens when you make dumb mistakes like that, Jaden. You never want to set Grand Mole. He's okay in attack mode. All right. Bye, Bubble Man. Oh, man. All right. Heavy Storm time. Yeah, losing that Miracle Fusion is honestly okay. All right. So he's going to go into Wild Edge as well, because of course. There he is. Hello, Wild Edge. Gonna go play Fusion Recovery as well to add those two back to his hand. And what monster is gonna summon with this? Please don't be Mariner. Please don't be Mariner. Gosh dang it. I was hoping for Steam Healer. Wait, what? Oh, right. Well, Boku would protect protected Shining Angel to begin with. Oh, shoot. Bye, Mariner. You know, part of me was kind of hoping Mudball Man, but oh well. Yeah, I know. I'm not the... Even though I'm not the biggest fan of Mudball, man, I would have still preferred seeing him over, you know. You know what? Speaking of which. We'll, we'll summon Mudball. Yeah. Say hello to Mudball, man, everybody. Everyone's favorite hero, I guess. Alright, now let's move into battle and go ahead and have Wild Edge attack Shining Angel. And see where this takes us. Yep, they're not going to use that effect because they, the AI knows Wild Edge will just murder them all. Oh, hi, Marauding Captain. I have a lot of good memories from Marauding Captain. Oh, it was one of my favorite cards growing up. All right, now let's go ahead and end my turn. All right, so... Cool, I guess. Nice, string up for Sinatrix. Why not summon... Oh, no, not Kelbeck! A monster got a really, really annoying retrain that had to get limited recently. <laughs> but that's still game. Get the crud out. Awesome. Alright, so that's the second round finished. So moving on to the next round. Alright, let's go ahead and begin our duel. Oh boy. Okay, so I believe we'll have two more duels after this to do. And then I'm free to open as many booster packs as I want. Because I really want Neos, dang it. 
All right. I know I could probably just go to the stinking what's his face uh, card generator area and just insert the code that I have for my copy of Neos. But eh, where's the fun in that? All right. So Jane's going to start off pretty strong. And of course, he's going to go ahead and summon Wild Edge off the bat because gosh dang it. There he is. Hello, Wild Edge. All right. Now he's going to add Blade Edge back to his hand with Ro with that. Proceed to go into another copy of Wild Edge. I don't know if that's the smartest move ever, but oh well. And then he's going to go ahead and set Percent Tricks face down and... Okay. Hello, Nightmare Steel Cage. Hello, Dark Door. Hello, Our Righteous Justice. Okay, so I have quite a few things I can do. So first things first, we'll flip summon Percent Tricks. Activate Our Righteous Justice. Destroy, destroy, destroy. Oh, man. Okay, so I think I know what I'm going to do. I am going to set up for Shining Flare. Send you. Activate you so I can go ahead and send Sparkman. And now I can Miracle Fuse. Hello, my friend. I know I could also send Dandelion to the graveyard, which I do plan on doing if things go haywire, but I don't think they are. Alright, there he is. Oh wait, does he not gain anything? Okay, so I'm gonna do something really quick. Someone clay man. Okay, so this might be a misuse of Foolish Burial, but I'm gonna put Necroshade in there. Just so Shining Flare can gain a little, just a few more attack points. Oh yay, Sangan. Cool. Well, there goes that. There goes another 800. 12. And this should be game. Thank you, Wild Edge. I can always count on you. And you, Wild Edge. <laughs> Alright. Game. Get the crud out. And we got some more good old DP. Alright, so that means only two more duels to go. Let's do this thing. So, where the heck is everyone else? Probably over here. Yep, here they are. All right, let's rock. Oh, boy. Yeah, Obelisk duels are always pretty stressful just because you never know what dumb crud they're gonna have. Since, you know, Obelisk, duel, Obelisk Blue are the highest ranked duelists in the school, yada yada, even though they're the duelists who have the most on-screen losses, yada yada. <laughs> anyway. I, I mostly blame Chaz for that. Anyway. Uh, could have been a better opener, but it's okay. Alright, so this guy's just gonna set a couple cards face down. And that's... Acid Trap Hole. That's annoying. Alright, so I'm gonna play on defense right now and send Dandelion to the grave. So now I get two Fluffy Tokens. Nice. Set Clayman face down along with Mirror Force and End. I love Dandelion. It's such a fun card. Aw, oh, Clayman, no! Ah, oh, crud. Alright. Yeah, I'm gonna use the Mirror Force right now. I'm not taking any risks. Yes, did I just use Mirror Force to protect tokens? Of course I did. Because now, Jaden's gonna be able to go all stinking in. Oh my lord! Jaden! You could have just Miracle Fuse and not waste- Whatever, whatever. Oh well. At, at least wild, wild Edge is able to do some good damage. Okay. Okay, this'll work. Summon Wild Heart. Set this face down. Equip Wild Heart. With Mage Power. Special Summon Bubble Man. Move into battle. We will have Wild Edge attack. Zombie Pyramid. Okay. Or Pyramid Turtle. My bad. Okay, so for some reason, he's just going to keep summoning them. Alright, get out of here, Pyramid Turtle. Hello, Pyramid Turtle number three. Wild Edge, just keep up the barrage. And the Kick Man. 
I only remember this card because you say used it whenever he was in prison. At 1.5 Ds. And come to think about it, I only remember uh, some of the older cards because of that episode of 5 Ds. Alright, time to end. This guy's just gonna go and set a monster face down. And so we're gonna win! Alright, Jaden, end this. Game. Oh, man. That was easy. Alright, so now we're gonna go on to the final duel, I believe. Yep, one more to go, I think. Alright, so, let's do this thing. Because, holy crud, we're almost done. After this duel, we should be good. Okay, so we lost that, but that's okay. As long as Jane and I have both uh, both have good starting hands, we'll be fine. Which, somehow, I kind of doubt, but we'll see. Alright, bring it on. So, okay, I have an okay starting hand. I can work with this. Jaden also has a decent starting hand, I guess. And he's gonna set Avion and two, mo uh, two cards face down. And good. And there's Horus. Ah, oh, crud. Okay, so yeah, we are definitely going to be losing Avion. But we got Stratos. Stratos makes up for anything. Alright, so he's gonna go ahead and add Blade Edge to his hand. Not the best pick. Ah, oh, crud! Not Ring of Destruction. I hate that card. And now Horus turns into its other variant, so that's not good. Okay, so we can summon the Wingman, but I do want to do something right now. We are going to bring back Stratos to the field. Activating his effect. So I'm going to add another Stratos to my hand. Normal summon you. Activate your effect, so I can go ahead... Uh, what would be a good card to add in this scenario? Ugh. Just Flame Wingman can... It definitely can't get over that. Neither can Wild Wingman. Do I have any other options? I guess I'll add... Oh, wait! That's right! Wait! Oh, wait. I already normal summoned. Dang it. I guess Clayman. Alright, what's the graveyard like right now? Okay. Uh, let's play Foolish Burial. And send... <sighs> let's put Necro Shade in the grave. Aw, oh, dang it! I could've just added Blade. Oh, I already normal summoned. I couldn't do that anyway. Alright, we're playing Polymerization then. We're gonna go ahead and summon Flame Wingman. To just do a lot of damage to Spirit Reaper. Because Spirit Reaper might actually be their downfall. Since it cannot be destroyed by battle. So now I'm gonna go ahead and activate Fusion Recovery. Add Burstin Tricks back to my hand. And now I'm gonna go ahead and summon Rampart Blaster. Alright. And here you are. Say hello to Rampart Blaster. Alright, so now we're going to go into battle and have Wingman attack. So that is 18. Stratos and the... Like, both of my Stratoses can go in for 3... Or can go in for a combined total of 3k. And that means Rampart for game. Get the heck out of here! G G. Oh my lord! Stop, Gabriel and Jaren winners all losing team scram. Oh look at here, last team standing is Gabriel and Jaden. They did good. So here's your pro. Oh my lord! All right, awesome. Jane's friendship is also is almost maxed out as well. Alright, so now 
what we're going to go ahead and do is buy some cards and then end the episode because holy crud, this has gone on for a moment. To the store! Oh my lord, okay, there's quite a few people in here. Bastion, what are you doing here? Oh wait, he's always here. Anyway. Yeah, we've yet to do a Bastion, so that's on my list. And oh, yay, don't stop. This is one of the worst packs in the game because because it just has nothing but forbidden cards. That's why it's one of the worst. It's literally there just for collection purposes. All right. We're all right. Yeah, I'm just gonna buy out a whole bunch of these Neos packs just because I'm I really want to get at least one copy Neos two two if I can. All right. That should be good, and then I'll focus the rest on Jaden's uh, friendship. Yes, we got Neos! We got one copy! Good! Good to see you, Neos. Alright, what else did we get? So, okay, Penny. He is in this game. Neos Alias! Oh my gosh, it's good to see him! Alias is going to be really helpful, and so will you, Pathfinder. Yeah, because... Alias is... Oh, we got another Grand Mold. Not like we needed it, though. And we got another Convert Contact. Good. Yeah, okay. So now I'm just going to focus on Jane's friendship with this money. Which shouldn't take too long. So, hello, Dorothy. Yes, I would like a sandwich. Alright. Doesn't matter which one we get, really. Because Jane's almost there. And then we can focus even more on the Neos pack. Okay. He should be good. I'll get one more for safekeeping. Alright, fermented soybean. Here you go, Jane. Okay, yep, he's maxed out for that heart. Fantastic. So that means I know what we're going to be doing in the next episode. But now, more Neo stuff. That's what we need. Alright, here we go. Just going to keep buying out these packs. So, yeah. Oh, so we have all the cards. We already bought out the entirety of this pack. But I mean... Uh, we now have 100% of the cards collected from here, but I just need, you know what. Alright. Yes, we now have three copies of Convert Contact. Awesome. And so far, do we get another copy of Neos? Yes, we got another copy of Neos. Cool, I just think I needed two. And another Dandelion. Don't really need him, but that's fine. Okay. Looking good. And I think... I'm gonna spend a few on this one just because I want some more draw power and if I can get morphing jar that would be absolutely incredible all right let's see card penalty necklace of command oh shoot this has deck devastation virus I can't really use it but that's fine reload card of sanctity which is infinitely worse in this game chaos greed do, -do, -do. Protector of the Sanctuary. This means that your opponent cannot draw cards except for draw phases. That's nice. Skell Angel. Okay, Legacy of Yadagrasu. Yamada Dragon. Terrible deal. Lucky Iron Axe. Oh, Crud Smoke Grenade. That was really good in the past, but... but not, no, sorry, that was really good recently, but not so much in the past. Alright, so now I think we are good. So next time on Yu-Gi-Oh! GX Tag Force 2, I'm going to build a Neos deck. Is it going to be horrible? Maybe. Is it going to be fun? Oh, definitely. So thank you so much for watching, and have a good day, guys. Bye!